Hello students, I am Ajay Karmarkar. Before starting video, I would like to tell you something. Please sit with copy pen. If you find somewhere important, pause the video, note it and proceed on. If you find somewhere difficulty, then please write in comment box. I will definitely solve your problem. And along with, please like, share and subscribe my channel that can reach more and more students. Thank you once again. Now here is the question. A trolley of mass 3 kg as shown in the figure is connected to two identical springs, each of spring constant 600 Newton per meter. If the trolley is displaced from its equilibrium position by 5 cm and released, the maximum speed of the trolley is, here we have given four options. Option A 0 0.5 meter per second, option B 1 meter per second, option C 2 meter per second and option D 3 meter per second. As we know that when any object or any body which is connected with a spring and whenever we have to give some push then it brings to be oscillate. Why it is oscillate? Because restoring force is generated and so therefore this F equal to minus Kx. But F equal to mass into acceleration. So here acceleration can be written as minus k x upon m. But for oscillatory motion, we know that A equal to minus omega square x. Okay, so now substitute this value minus omega square x equal to minus k x upon m. Here x x cancel out, minus minus cancel out, then omega can be written as k by m. Here k is the spring constant, m is the mass of this body. But in this case, you can see that here two springs, here two springs is connected, same k means spring constant is the same. But here they are different, different rigid bodies, they are strands. So therefore we can say that is a parallel because this type of arrangement, you can see they are not connected to each other, they are connected with the same body. So therefore we can say that is the parallel. And for effective k, Effective k can be written as k1 plus k2. Here the same spring constant. So therefore 600 plus 600, how much? 1200. Okay. So now substitute all this value omega equal to root 1200 upon. What is n is given? 3 kilogram. So here 400 then omega equal to 20 radian per second. Okay, that is the angular velocity, but we have to find out the linear velocity, maximum linear velocity. So, what is the formula of velocity of the particle which brings to be oscillate? Omega root a square minus x square. For the maximum condition, v equal to omega a. Okay, here a is the amplitude, omega is the angular velocity. Here, what is amplitude is given? 5 centimeter. Let us first we have to convert into meter and uh, divided by 100, then we get 0 0.05 meter, okay. Here we have already find out it is 20 and 0 0.05. So here 25 is a 100, 5, 5, 1. cancel out, then v equal to 1 meter per second, okay. That is maximum. So let's see which option is matched here. Option D is correct. Okay, I hope so. You understood this question. Thank you for staying till the end of this video. Definitely, when you will become success, whole contribution goes to your hard work. But if my videos, my lectures, my questions will help in your success, I will consider myself lucky. Please like, share, and subscribe my channel that can reach more and more students. Thank you once again. Take care. Bye bye.